this video will help you understand what kind of occupation and what kind of courses you should select or what kind of education you should take if you want to apply for permanent resident visa in Australia so I have uh, divided this in five categories as you can see arts commerce trade then science that is physics chemistry biology that stream and then finally again science uh, including physics chemistry and maths so based upon education system in India I have categorized these things so let us say you have done arts education in India then what kind of occupation you can uh, choose here in Australia so that you can get PR visa so you can become social worker then you can become teacher agriculture consultant agricultural scientist barrister solicitor all these kinds of occupations are available for you so if you want to like you know come here and uh, study further you can select such course uh, that is aligned with these occupations and then you can apply for PR very easily because all these occupations that are uh, that are that you are seeing over here are actually in medium to long term list next uh, category is commerce so let us say you have done commerce education in india then you can become auditor accountants that kind of occupations you can choose in australia and then you can get pr visa then let us say you have done uh, something like it course or trade kind of course then what kind of occupations are available for you here in australia for trades there are lots of uh, types of occupations here you can see surveyor air conditioning and mechanical service plumber air conditioning and refrigeration mechanic automotive electrician boat builder and repair electrician cabinet maker carpenter carpenter and joiner plumber electrician special class digital motor mechanic drainer electrical engineering technician child care center manager bricklayer electronic equipment trades worker electronic instrument trades worker electronic uh, instrument trades worker special class fibrous plaster fitter fitter and turner welder gas fitter glazier horse trainer joiner lift mechanic locksmith metal fabricator metal machinist motor mechanic motorcycle mechanic painting trades worker panel builder chef pressure welder telecommunication technician roof plumber sheet metal trades worker shipwright small engine mechanic soil solid plaster sto stone mason technical cable jointer oil and floor tiler welder civil engineering technician so th all these occupations are available for you or you can also alternatively take uh, admission to any of the courses that is aligned with this trade occupations in TAFE so TAFE is technical education institute just like how we have got ITI in India so TAFE is uh, like provide similar kind of education over here and then you can become a trade now uh, finally I'm gonna tell you what kind of occupations are available if you have done physics chemistry biology in 12th if you have done let us say PCM uh, if you have got PCM subjects physics chemistry maths then what kind of occupations are available for you so let us first uh, see this PCB stream you can become doctor nurse di dentist lab scientist pathologist cardiologist cardio thoracic uh, surgeon clinical hematologist then dermatologist diagnostic and interventional radiologist emergency medicine specialist endocrinologist gastroenterologist general practitioner intensive care specialist medical oncologist medical practitioners neurologist neurosurgeon obstetrician ophthalmologist orthopedic surgeon pediatric surgeon pediatrician pathologist plastic and reconstructive surgeon psychiatrist radiation oncologist renal medicine specialist rheumatologist special physician surgeon thoracic medicine specialist urologist vascular surgeon optometrist occupational therapist speech pathologist finally we have got uh, pcm stream that is physics chemistry maths if you studied the subjects in 12 then what kind of uh, course you can take or what kind of occupation you can choose you can become software developer all the information technology related uh, these things occupations software engineer analyst programming etc then uh, apart from that you can also become uh, aeronautical engineer agricultural engineer all engineering related occupations are there biomedical engineer chemical engineer civil engineer electrical engineer then electronics engineer engineering professionals engineering technologist environmental engineer geotechnical engineer industrial engineer materials engineer mechanical engineer mining engineer naval architect petroleum engineer production or plant engineer structural engineer telecommunication so based upon uh, this information you can decide like what occupation is best suitable for your career once you decide like uh, I want to become chemical engineer I, or I want to become dermatologist or I want to become barrister or solicitor then next step is choosing a course 
Now let us say uh, you want to become a software tester. Then what you have to do is you have to go to this website abs.gov.eu and there you can search for the ANZ SEO codes. For a specific uh, ANZ SEO code they will give you all the details like what kind of uh, task roles responsibilities you are supposed to do then for that occupation what kind of occupations are related to that particular roles and responsibilities all these things you will find it here and what you have to do is that when choosing the course you have to check that you have to ensure that your subjects and the units that you are going to study are aligned with these uh, roles and responsibilities and then only you, you have to choose that particular course that way what will happen is that after you complete your education it will be easier for you to you know apply for a specific occupation if you have more questions related to this let me know through the comments thanks for watching this video